giving new hair who this. I just wanna lay down. Finally know what it feels like when Ariana Grande wears her ponytails. <laughs> We're not doing this again. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Sydney Marie, and by the title, you guys can tell that today I'm gonna to be doing a really huge Shein haul. Of course, I picked out 32 plus items. Really excited to show you guys these pieces because I did pick up a lot of spring, kind of early spring pieces, I guess. I filmed this video about two to three times, you guys. Honestly, I don't know what was going on with me when I tried to film this about an hour or two ago, but I was, it just wasn't having it, like, I wasn't able to do it. I kept stopping and stuttering and I had to refilm a lot of things and I don't like to do my videos like that because when I edit them, it's always really hard to go back and like go through all my mistakes, so I decided to just film it over. If you wanna follow me on Instagram, definitely follow me at sydneymarie.e. When I'm not on here, I'm on there, I'm always active, so you guys should definitely follow me on there. And lastly, I do wanna talk about my outfit. I know a lot of people always ask what I'm wearing in my videos. I usually try to link it sometimes, but this time I'm actually just gonna tell you. But my drawer is from Ana Luisa Jewelry and Sylvia my ring is Princess Polly, my shirt is Princess Polly, this bracelet is Amazon, earrings are Amazon, and bottoms are Ross. But I guess we should go ahead and jump right in. I do have a lot of things. Now there is three items in this haul that I actually bought myself in their accessories. I literally go on Shein for no reason at all and I see something that I really like and I'm like, you know what? I just need to get it right now. We'll have the items that I bought myself linked at the top and then the other items that were sent will be linked all at the bottom. So first accessory I got are these sunglasses. They definitely resemble the Dior sunglasses, which is why I got them. This is what they look like on. I love the baby pink color and I just love the color of the shade itself. I'm super into these and I know it's winter so you may think that you can't really rock sunglasses, but honestly, let me tell you, accessories always make or break your fit. So if you have a nice pair of sunglasses, it can really up your look. The next thing I got were these leather headbands or pleather headbands. So I really do have a vision for these. Now, I'm going to show y'all what this one looks like on me right now just so y'all can get an idea of what it's given. But I would not, no, nah, I wouldn't wear it with this. But I know with a really cute like half up half down ponytail with like my natural hair and like maybe an extension or maybe even like a wig. I think this would be really cute. So it's in my favorite colors, brown and you know the neutral nude tone. I mean, please. If you don't know my favorite colors by now, then what are you doing? I love these so much, y'all. And I don't know. I mean, I just felt like I needed to have a girly headband. I don't really wear headbands like this. I have a bunch of, like, sparkly headbands that I don't wear. Eventually, they'll get worn. I mean, who knows? The next item I got are a pair of fuzzy slides. Now, I normally don't get slides from Shein only because, y'all, they are the most uncomfortable things ever. No shade to Shein. I'm sure all their slides aren't like this. But these type of ones, like this, they're definitely hard as rock still like them a lot though i think they're really cute for style i don't think they're functional in a sense of like walking around a theme park or walking in a park with this but i feel like if you're going to be sitting down outside at an event that you're like having like lawn chairs i'm thinking of summer y'all like this is how you know there's something wrong with me but in a sense of that i think these would be perfect and slides i do wear a size eight i picked these up in a medium and they fit perfectly so the last three accessories I have are bags. Now, y'all know, I think my new obsession is quilted and chain bags. So, y'all gonna see a play on this when I show you these items. So, this first bag I got is the Bottega Bag Dupe. Now, I love Bottega bags. And, you know, I am not rich. So, dupes is what it wears at right now. But this is supposed to look like the Bottega Bag. Now, I actually have another dupe that looks exactly like this. But there is a black strap instead of the chain. I love the quality of the quilted bag. I love the chain in the front. I don't know how the rusting like how it will do with rusting i will definitely fill you guys in as i wear it but i got this bag because i've seen tiara walker of course with the actual white bottega bag this is gonna be as close as i get to the bottega bag in this days of age but maybe sooner or later you know i'll be able to get it to continue the whole quilted chain trend i did get this really cute nude one now this one is a little bit flatter and it's also doesn't come with the flap like the other one does you can turn this into a crossbody bag if you want to or you can just wear it as is like this i don't know if i'm fond of the whole rustic chain i don't know if you can tell but the chain is a little bit more on the rustic side just know that the golds in the chains are a little bit different but the cool thing about this is that you can take these off if you want to so this is the last bag and i believe this is supposed to be a 
Zara dupe. Now, I've never seen it on Zara, but I have watched a video of a lady comparing Shein clothing to like Zara clothing as far as dupes. So this is definitely one of the bags that she had on there. It's not as quilted, but you can see there is a few quilts. It has silver hardware, which many bags that I get actually have the gold. So I'm surprised that this one even has the silver, but it has a Sherpa lining. And then you can also turn this bag into a crossbody if you want to. The quality is a little bit on the thin side, but more or less, I think it's a really stylish bag. I feel so much better after I ate, y'all. Like now, I feel like I'm really getting through this haul. Before, I feel like I was definitely making a lot more mistakes. I ate a mac and cheese cup. Crafter Velveeta. This is not the question of the day, but Crafter Velveeta. So now we're gonna jump into the clothes. Now, I did get one coat, and I said this was gonna be a more spring-like haul, which it is, but I wanted this coat for so long, and y'all gonna see why. So this is definitely that TikTok coat, and when I say TikTok coat, you guys probably already know what I'm talking about. I'm 100% sure if you're on TikTok, you know what I'm talking about. It's this padded coat with the quilted, not quilted, but the sleeves that cinch in at the bottom. Why did I say quilted? Like it's not quilted i really do like this coat now i did have to size up into a small because the extra smalls were sold out but i do think it gives a really nice oversized look i do wish they had my size though because i didn't want this to fit a little bit more fitted on me but the oversized look is still really nice so the next two pieces i got are actually tracksuit sets so they're actually for my mom now i always get so many things from shein that every time when i do get some things i always ask some of my friends or my mom anybody in my house like is there anything that they want most of the time they really don't be wanting anything sometimes they do this case my mom did want two tracksuits so I let her you know go ahead and get it but I'm really thinking I should probably get one for myself because I love the color scheme it's definitely giving me like skims kkw like Kanye theme if that makes sense just these stone colored or I mean I guess it's stone but it really does look almost like a stone brown color but it's just these tracksuit bottoms right and also comes with the sports bra which i will show you in a second but these ones are supposed to make your butt look really nice i think this is really stylish and i absolutely love the color i did get this in a size medium but again it's not for me it's for my mom and this is what the top looks like it does have the padding but there is an option to take it out which i always love because i never really like padding in bras i mean it depends but more than likely i'll end up taking it out and then it is a razor bag so i'm gonna actually have my mom try this on and have a clip on the side so you guys can kind of see what it looks like on her and get reference maybe one day i'll start working out or doing something get a membership like that's always been my dream to get like a planet fitness membership or something like that maybe one day the next tracksuit i picked up for her is kind of like a play on the off-white but obviously not off-white so it comes with a long sleeve black and white kind of gray top the material is very similar to the last one but it does have a little bit less stretch i'm also thinking i probably should have picked up something like this just because it's so cute really stylish and although as i said before i don't work out these are still really nice pieces to wear when you go on a walk a hike then it comes with a regular pair of leggings so it looks like this they do look a little bit short but i believe as you put them on they'll stretch to go further down but when my mom tries them on you guys will definitely see what that looks like so now we're gonna go ahead and get started with the clothes that i picked up for myself so i did get a lot of color i mean it's more than i usually get it is still a little bit of brown tones grays blacks but i feel like i did get a little bit more color this time so you know what we stepping out the box it's improvement so i picked up three different colors of these and you guys know in my last haul that i did pick up this same bodysuit but i got it in different colors of course I did end up sizing up to a small i said in my last video that i would get a small if i ever you know decide to get it again so i did size up to smalls in every single one of the bodysuits now i only tried on one of them and it's too big the other bodysuits are scattered throughout this haul, so as I go through, you guys will end up seeing them. This next piece I got is not spring at all, but it's a really cool layering piece. And you know, the good thing about, you know, spring and wearing jackets, you can always tie them around your waist or you can even do like an off the shoulder type look. This is supposed to be a grayish color, but I feel like their gray stone color is very similar to like a brown mix. This is giving me brown. Like, I don't know if this is supposed to be that color. I'll have to look and see what I put in, like, on the link, whatever I ordered. Because I swear this was supposed to be gray. But I still like the color. And it looks so brown. Like, it looks like a dark chocolate brown, does it not? I mean, on camera, it looks very brown. But then in person, like, I can see the potential of the gray. In the reviews, the people also said to size up if you want a more, like, baggy look. So I did go about maybe two or one sizes up. I definitely feel like I could have gotten this in a large. I would have preferred a large, but it does still fit really nice on me. And it's in between that kind of thick, thin material, not too thin. I always look the reviews to check because I hate a thin, like, jacket. Like, that's probably one of my pet peeves, a thin, not fleece hoodie. I can't deal with it. I can't. So I did get another hooded jacket. This one I did 
did get in a size large. Now it is on the thin side and I know I said that I really do be looking at the reviews to see. I got this in a larger size and I do think I can deal with it being a little bit thin. If I would have got it in my regular size I know I would not have liked it but the main reason I did get this jacket is because drum roll please the color i'm so obsessed with this blue tone it's not even something i need to mention anymore because i say it in every single one of my videos but this pale blue color is chef's kiss but i got this in a size large i probably could have gotten this in a medium it is pretty big but of course it's for layering so i really don't mind i love hoodies i have way too many already i don't even know where i'm gonna fit this like everyone always asks me where do you fit your clothes at and y'all i give away so many clothes i do keep a lot of clothing and i do have different spots and different ways to kind of you know have a nice little storage plan in my room but listen it's, it's getting real full real quick so this is a sage green bodysuit or more like a turquoise i really don't know what this would be you know, I mean, it's kind of green. It's it's green. It's green. Let's face it. I'm actually so sad that these don't fit me as perfectly as I want them to because they're so freaking cute. But if I can't make them work, you guys know that I'm going to be doing like my second round of Poshmark sales on here very, very soon. Well, not on here, but I'll announce it on here. First time I sold clothes on Poshmark, I sold everything within maybe two weeks. So that was amazing. Hopefully, you know, I'll put up some more stuff and you guys like it. But, but definitely look out for it because I will be putting up some more stuff very soon. So this next piece I have is what I call like my inner Paris Hilton inner Juicy Couture moment because of course it is love a tracksuit bottoms i low-key wish that i got a matching top to go with it but i didn't it's okay though because i can definitely make it work without it now this is definitely giving me like in the summer spring crop top sunnies like that's what this is giving it's a very nice material not too thin i really like the pockets because they're actually lined with the velvet now the inner side of the pant is not lined but you still get that kind of luxe feel from it it's very nice they're super long you guys will see what these look like on the try on and i honestly can't wait to style them my shein hauls would not be complete if i didn't get a two-piece set so i did pick up this really cute nude cropped two-piece set so it comes with this really cool like scuba neck or a scuba lined type top it's cropped it's very very short like this is definitely shorter than i expected but it's still really cute and then it comes with these shorts now the material it seems like it'd be ribbed but it's more like a jersey stretchy material and then it has like these shorts here it's definitely gonna be something that i wear in the late spring as you guys know i've been trying to pick up some more pieces because i have so much winter stuff like it's about time that i rebrand like re not rebrand but redecorate my room for spring because i have a bunch of coats out jackets this is a little bit on the thin side so definitely keep that in mind if you're going to purchase this yes i got another two-piece set don't say anything i know y'all looking behind these cameras saying sydney with these two-piece sets i know i know i got this really cool furry two-piece sets these are super common to have you've probably seen them in like the pink one more commonly like the brown whatever but I was really debating on getting the pink one because I thought it was so cute and it really kind of woke the soft girl inside of me but the other girl that likes blue said no so but this is what it looks like it's just a furry crop top and then it also comes with these really cool bottoms now I do wish the bottoms a little bit more fitted but I think it's still nice and they're definitely really cool as a lounge set I've never actually seen like anybody wear these out besides on Instagram pictures so I don't know if I'll actually wear them out. This may be just like a little chill look to wear in the house or maybe to film some videos, take some pictures in, but we'll see. So these next items I got are actually a set, a four piece set, not two, not three, four. So it comes with these really cool like razor back knit tops or with spandex. They're 90% nylon, 10% spandex. So yeah, it's just like that kind of stretchy material. But these types of tops have been something that's been my favorite thing to wear. And especially because I don't have to wear them with a bra. Like I actually hate wearing bras. So it has a black one as well. It has this really cool white one. And then lastly, it comes with like a lilac grayish purple color. So I thought this would be gray when i first seen it on the website but it is more of a lilac purple which is really cute because i don't have anything this color in my wardrobe surprisingly i'm predicting it now but pastels i know pastels have already been a spring thing but watch them actually grow in the spring i feel like that's gonna be a new trend pastels because you know browns and stuff have been around this whole time but it didn't become a trend to like last year and now it's like continuing on i wonder if it'll ever run out do you guys think that browns will ever not be a trend probably not but i bet these pastel colors are gonna come back in style i don't want to roll with these colors like yellow when have i ever been seen wearing yellow so this is a pastel color i've been really into these soft colors lately like i don't know am i a soft girl now low-key but it's just this really cute yellow knit cardigan style top i thought this is really pretty on the model so i definitely wanted to pick it up i'm usually not really into yellow especially because i feel like it just looks like pee but but before anybody starts saying girl what 
that's not true because i already know y'all typing fingers I, I hear them before you get to type it i do want to say that i've been really liking this color more and i've been really liking yellow i mean this is a really nice piece and hopefully i don't go on shein the next time and try to get everything that's in yellow because so far i've been doing that with blue this is the last bodysuit that i have in this sleeveless style and it is in a nude color so this is the one that i ended up trying on that i thought was too big i don't know if the other ones feel like that but because the sizes are the same i would assume they do fit the same <sighs> if it's not my brothers or parents interrupting me it's the dang airplanes now you know how i feel like with these planes y'all know if you watch leah lee it's always a train in her video for me it's always planes next thing i got were these really cute fleece shorts now these are so comparable to the princess polly ones that i got if you haven't checked out my instagram to see that picture I'll put it up on the screen, but I wore some shorts that are in this similar material from Princess Polly. They were a little bit more on the pricier side, but still really cute. But they have these really cool pockets, and they're really nice fleece thick material like i really like these and also i think they'd be really cute for the spring this would be cute with this to be honest i low-key want to change and just put these on but this is just what they look like very stretchy and just super good quality they're super cute definitely recommend 10 out of 10. so i got this really cool cross stitch top i've been really into cross stitch lately if you watch my videos a lot you know that i'm picking up a lot of cross stitch so i ended up picking up this really cool brownish nude moment they did have like a sage green one and a purple one i believe but this one stood out to me the most <laughs> just what it looks like it's really stretchy it's really good material and i love the way it fits on me as well like it kind of gives you that baby tee fit this next thing i got is a bodysuit oh that is not the right end this is just what it looks like i actually seen this on their website um few ago like a while ago but i seen it in a lot of different types of styles so like i think they have maybe a v-neck style more knit type style they be printing these out like crazy. I got this in an extra small and I should have known that this jersey material would just be a little bit too big. I feel like jersey stuff tends to run a little bit bigger and you know they don't have an extra extra small so this is what I had to settle with. The concept is really cute and I like what they were doing but I just don't know if this is something that I see myself wearing all the time. I may change my mind when I try it on again but as it stands right now you know it's not my favorite piece of the bunch. This next thing I got is a brown dress. This is definitely one of those dresses that you guys have probably seen everybody wear. Now when I got this, I could have sworn it was supposed to be like a mesh see-through. I probably wasn't looking right and I think they may have different versions of this as well. I told myself I wasn't going to get it but I thought it was really cute and I seen this girl's haul and she had a dress just like this. I'm not sure if it was from Shein but I can assume so and it looked so good on her you guys. So freaking good. So this next piece I got is another sleeveless type top but it also has this like mock neck. It's very very thin and quite see-through like how the neck stretches enough because you know there is types of tops that you get like this that the neck is just way too restricting like i had something from pretty little thing it's been a couple instances where i've got something from pretty little thing right and the neck like i could not fit my head through there like at all the sweatshirt that i had gotten my last pretty little thing haul y'all i tried to try it on my head would not fit and i have a big head but my head is not that big this is just what that looks like it's just a sleeveless top and honestly i tried this on but i can't remember if it fit well or not so you guys will definitely see in the try on portion the next piece i got is supposed to be a baby tee as i thought but it is a little bit big this is not my style at all like this is not my style <laughs> you know this is giving me princess poly vibes and i'm saying this is not my style but i'm literally wearing something that's like it, this gives this if that makes sense when i say this is not my style like i don't mean this is ugly or nothing because i got it because i thought it was cute but it's giving me very teenager vibes like senior junior high school <laughs> it's really stretchy and the material is really nice I, i'll give it that for sure and i did get it in a size small this next thing i got is a dress now this is gonna look real real raggedy right now because it's not ironed or nothing like that but if you guys watch it's okay not to be okay on netflix it's a korean drama if you guys know who moon what's her name oh lord this is sucky bro how do i not know her name okay ko moon young her name is ko moon young and y'all this gives ko moon young and i'm gonna try it on with the corset so i can kind of see or i may just answer the picture of when i did try it on with the corset but this is her energy like completely i actually seen something like this on princess polly the main reason i got it because i love the sleeve in now it's gonna be real difficult for me to show y'all what it looks like right now and it may not look that flattering on right now but it is a really cute like t-shirt dress it's super super short so i would definitely recommend you wearing some real like short spandex shorts up under this if you don't want to flash nobody but 
to each his own. So this next piece I got is another knit piece. Now I did not know they had a chocolate brown in this. Like this is so freaking cute. And I'm actually really sad because I gave my sage green one away. Honestly don't regret it because I don't wear it that much. But this brown one y'all. This brown one is definitely giving a whole different look. This is so cute though you guys. It's really stylish. I love the material. And just look at those ruffles. Like that's really giving soft girl. Is that my new word? Soft girl? Like child you're not a soft girl this next piece i got is a really cute cutout bodysuit and it's in this really nice sage green color so it has a lighter sage on this side and then a darker sage I'm obsessed with cutouts so this is definitely something that i had to pick up and it looks really really good on and i just love that it's a bodysuit like bodysuits are so universal y'all i'm sure all of you have tried out bodysuits but if you never tried out bodysuits you definitely need to hop on that trend because it's so nice this is definitely a really unique different type piece and when i go on shein i always try to look for like different things i used to watch shein hauls and kind of take inspiration and of course I still do but lately I've been really searching through Shein to find out some bomb items so you know gotta give me a pat on the back you know to my own horn but this next piece I got is a white shirt I actually have something exactly like this from yes style but it has like a sleeve on it and it is a little bit less tight than this one but it's a veed or is that more of like a scoop neck so I guess it's more scoop neck it's real like low and it's a white rib top that's in a long sleeve form this is super thin so it's definitely something that you can still wear in the spring I just love white I don't have enough white okay actually I'm lying I do have a lot of white it is one of those sleek icy colors so if I ever want to look kind of like icy and you know cool i feel like i would wear this i don't know not cool like cool but cool like I see. Next piece I got is a two-piece set. Low-key regret getting this. Well, you know, I'm not even gonna say I low-key regret getting it, but it's an army green two-piece set. So this is what the top looks like. It's a little bit on the crop side, and then this is what the bottoms look like. So they're more of like a tight fit and bottom, right? Like, don't get me wrong, this is really cute, but it's a little bit different than what I expected it. And the material is also a little bit different than I thought it would be. It's on the see-through side, and it also doesn't have a whole lot of stretch. Like it has a little bit, but if you are thinking about you know picking up this piece definitely go true to size because i don't think it stretches a whole lot like look at that that's not really that much stretch next item i got is one of those knit button type tops and it also has like a little split hem on the sleeve and i forgot exactly how awkward it fits because i haven't tried this one in a couple of days but i do remember this fitting a little bit strange like up in this area if i'm not mistaken i love the whole button situation now, i actually don't have a piece like this surprisingly so i did want to go ahead and pick it up it really does remind me of something i got from pretty little thing as far as the sleeves being split hem but other than that like you know really nice piece Okay, so we have two more. Oh, is it two more pieces or is it three? Okay, we have three more pieces left. What this piece looks like, it's a really cute knit piece and it has some ties on the side so you can kind of do like a crisscross in the back and a crisscross in the front. The material is actually really thick and it's not super see-through at all, which is why I really like this. It's also really, really soft. I absolutely love the material of this. It's definitely, you know, a very simple piece, but I think you can definitely style it up or you can style it down. This next piece I got is a tracksuit. So this actually came sold separately, but I I got it in my last haul as well but you guys already know what this is i told y'all that i would get this in a blue color because i did see it last time i was looking on shein so it's one of those tracksuit tops in this really cool blue color and then it's also the track bottoms i'm gonna say this again but shein's athleisure y'all amazing spot on amazing quality i definitely want to get some more higher end athleisure to kind of compare it to shein to see you know what's the hype but so far you know without any comparison i still do feel like it's a really nice affordable piece so this last piece i got is another one of those button type tops and i don't know if this was the one that fit weird or if it was the other one that fit weird because i forgot that i even got this but this is more on the purple side like i can definitely categorize this as a more violet purple piece i thought it'd be a little bit more pale but you know i'm not mad i'm not complaining at all the material of this one is a little bit different it's more cottony less stretchy it still does have some stretch to it don't get me wrong but it does feel a little bit different than the last one i feel like the last one was more like a jersey material if that makes sense and it's just this really nice long sleeve top it is a little bit on the thinner side so of course definitely spring approved but that's the end of this haul if you did like this video definitely give it a big thumbs up don't forget to hit that subscribe button because i'm noticing that more than half actually are not subscribed so if you haven't clicked that subscribe button what you doing it's, it's right there it doesn't take much <laughs> definitely leave a like and definitely leave a comment down below don't forget to respond to the question of the day and if you are going to pick up any of these pieces definitely use my code sydney to get you 15 percent off follow me on my instagram at sydneymarie.e I'm always posting on there. But that was it for this video. I hope you guys enjoy it. And I will see you guys in my next upload.